Oh, thank you. I'm, I'm live. Whoops, sorry. I'll talk to you about it after. <clears throat> Alrighty, welcome guys. Hope we're having a good day. Tap and share. Tap and share. Hello, hello. How is everyone's Friday? TGIF, let's go. Laura, welcome. Maria, welcome. Is a uh, not tap the screen. Melanie, hello, hello, Aaron, Jen Eagle, Jam. It's Friday. Let's go. Hi, Michelle. Lonnie, hello, hello. Good morning, Janet. Just set up this uh, this air tag. Anyone have an air tag? It's cool. I hope everyone's having a good day, guys. It's officially the weekend, basically. Basically the weekend. I'm just gonna write something down because I will forget. Um, welcome, Ali, Steph. Happy Friday, you guys. Give me one second. Alrighty, Portia, hello. Thank you for the follow, Lisa. Chantel, hello. hello. <clears throat> Hope we are all having a great day. Do you order food? No, Black 18 Mom just brought me back some food because she went to some like burrito place. Love the hoodie, thank you. It's my new hoodie. Repping the university we went to. Got this in London. Wendy, hello. Hello, hello. All right, let's start off with our, you're at 3.7. Really? Let's go. When did that happen? Hi, Susie. Just set up the air tag. It's sick. Not a low. Samantha, welcome, welcome. Lydia. 3.7? Weren't we just at 3.5? Let's see when that hit. That's crazy. I don't notice these things. Oh, it is 3.7. It just hit. Nice. Amazing. Amazing. 3.7. Let's freaking go. Beauty. You look cozy. You're cold today. A little bit. A little bit. This is my, my cozy outfit. Uh, it's basically winter, guys, you know? <clears throat> thank you, thank you, thank you, appreciate it. Lonnie, hello. Love the hoodie, it's so comfy. So glad I got it, cause you'd think after going to the school for five years, I'd get a purple hoodie, but I didn't. Now we got more purple. Chantal loves the purple. Let's go. Karen, hello, Sarah. Welcome. I hope you all had a good day today. It's Friday. It's the beginning of the weekend. I wrote my friend. I'm like, happy Saturday. He's like, bro, it's Friday. <laughs> Thank you, Maria. Francisca, hello, hello. Black kid, teen mom. Never got one either. Wait, you went to Western? Very cozy today. Cozy vibes. Hi, Lucia. I wish it was Saturday. Why? Dr. Kaylee, hello. Um, go eat, it's hot. Um, I had something like two hours ago, so I'm gonna wait and then microwave it. I'm not too hungry right now, but I will eat it. Thank you. Then I would have the next three days off. Hey, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Um, oh, Mamma Mia. Okay, first we'll do this, then Mamma Mia. Then we'll talk about Mamma Mia. All right, the date today is October 11th. 
Is today the 11th? No. Alexa, what's the date today? Today is Friday, October 11th. It's the 11th. All right. October 11th. Okay. So the title for today is Share Your Truth. It's very short. Share your truth. And this is what it says. It says, communicate from that place in the center of your heart. Share your truth. You deserve to be heard. Speak honestly and fearlessly and share the dreams, stories, and words that may have been locked away that you might not want to share. So basically, it's just about opening up your heart, communicating your thoughts, being honest with yourself. Um, I think because of the judgment of society, um, we, we, we tend to keep things to ourselves. Jojo, thank you. But um, we got to almost eliminate judgment as much as we can because there will always be judgment there will always be people who have things to say or don't want to hear our truth but we got to speak from our heart we know ourselves better than anyone else and so you know if your intentions are pure whatever it is so if you're locking things away you're holding on to feelings emotions thoughts try to get it out there talk to someone even someone else you know a friend are you gonna take that book to florida there's no space no i'm not not i'll take a little bit of a break it's a great question yeah Dottie knows no, no space no space yeah florida doesn't allow books you can't read there only you can only lay out in the sun laura hello hello i need to hear that let's go let's go um yeah wow it's the 11th already what the heck holy that's crazy October's flying. Lonnie, thank you. Toppers, thank you. Let's tap all the way to 10K. Let's go, guys. Tap, tap, tap. We gotta we gotta get the taps up. Tap and share. Laying out in the sun sounds amazing. I don't even do that in Florida, which is wild. But I am excited for sunshine. Next week, we're off. We're off to Florida. Um, so yeah, last night went to go see Mamma Mia, the play, uh, or yeah, musical. Um, I had like, I guess like expectations of what I thought it would be like. Um, that was like phenomenal. Like I would not just even like, I wouldn't just say that that was actually like amazing. I was so impressed. I looked at black 18 mom at the end. I was like, that was like literally perfect. It was so good. So yeah, um, I see they're traveling around, they're traveling from like September all the way to May. So they might actually hit up your state or your country or your city. Um, like they're going to Naples, Florida. They're going to, I think, Mass. But yeah, you should check it out. Write Mommy a Musical on um, Google and then see if it hits your state. Because uh, honestly, that was fire. Um, so yeah, I really enjoyed it. The cast was amazing. The music was amazing. The costumes are good um favorite song i don't think i have a favorite i like the encore at the end they brought them out again and they did a couple songs that i was like they didn't do i thought they weren't gonna play waterloo and all these other songs but yeah they came out and they did that but yeah holy it was amazing it was amazing yeah i was like it was two and a half hours and i literally spider um I was so entertained. I didn't want it to end. <laughs> yeah. So now I just got to watch the movie. See, see if that's any good. But honestly, after going to three shows in the last uh, couple weeks, like the first two comedy shows don't even compare to this show. Like you can tell how much time they put into it. It was like amazing. It was amazing. So yeah, go see, go see mommy of the musical. If it's coming to you coming to you there's a couple of movies i'm gonna watch them all yeah i'm gonna watch them i don't know when but i'm gonna watch them but yeah guys holy i got like the goo you know like when music plays and you're just so into it you get like the goosebumps i was like damn and it was packed we were second row so it was awesome like i could see their sweat i could see everything um yeah it was amazing guys so go see it go see it it's the same cast 
uh, as they're traveling around U.S. and Canada, I think other countries. So you'll see who I see if you go to see it. Mayalolo. Yeah, it was awesome. Awesome. Is it at the Mervish? Mm, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's at the Mervish. Mission to... Um, oh, also, I was so impressed last night that I was like, I have to tell them. So what do I do? I find like the cast on Instagram. I just, I just, I don't know. I was like, they'll never read this, but I'm like, I'll just let them know. It was like the mom, the mom of like the, um, like the daughter. She, her voice was so good. I was so impressed. I'm like, you know what? Even if she doesn't read this, I'm going to write it to her. So I was like, yo, like that was amazing. And I woke up this morning and she wrote back. She was like, I forgot what she said, but she's like, you just put the biggest smile on my face. I have a interview with a news station and like, an hour and that just started my day off so well and i was like yo she actually replied holy heck um but yeah because i feel like you know clapping is one thing but like to get words like to get like someone to actually write to you i was like i saw your show last night and it was like phenomenal so like i think that's nice to hear you know like when you do a good job it's like is she on tiktok uh i don't know i don't know hi cheryl so sweet that's awesome you made her day better yeah yeah i honestly did not expect to hear back from her i'm like if she sees it amazing if she doesn't see it then i'm sure she'll hear from someone else that she did awesome but yeah her voice she was on broadway she was on like broadway for like seven years or something so yeah damn but i love musicals so much they're so good what is everyone's favorite musical if you could see any musical we're seeing Lion King, Black 18 Mom and I are seeing Lion King in a month, so that'll be good. Thank you for sharing, guys. We hit 10K likes. Let's go Hamilton. Yeah, Black 18 Mom and Black 18 Sis, they love that. I've never um, um, seen it. Never been to one? You gotta go to a musical. Gotta go to a musical. Lion King. Yeah, the Lion King one is supposed to be the most... I think on Broadway, Lion King has made the most from the box office so it's the biggest musical rent rent what's that about heard of it yeah so great time guys uh the headache was still there but it wasn't as bad it wasn't that bad i think i was so distracted by good music i'm like forgot about the headache and then i still have it though it's a little bad today lion king is the most theatrical yeah the costumes and stuff hi kate welcome welcome Welcome, welcome, welcome. But I'm sure we're all pumped that it is Friday. Dirty Dance in the Play. I'd love to see that. Hi, Nicole. How are you? Bye bye, Birdie. I think um, I think I saw that at camp. Lay Miz. You know what's crazy? This I didn't realize this. When you are in one of these shows like you might be like a backup so like i looked it up there was like this guy that was playing one of the dads and i was like he doesn't look like the main guy i saw in the pamphlet and i looked it up and they have subs so like there's this one guy that if three people can't make it three different people he can sub in for any of those three people that is such a tough job because like understudy that's what it's called yeah that's such a hard job because like you literally have to memorize the lines for everything. And I think the one thing that is, I was most impressed about with the show yesterday, and then I'll stop talking about it, was, um, you know how, like, when someone's singing, like, you're, you're looking at them? Well, like, I did something different. Like, sometimes I would look at other people in the background, and they're all, like, on point. Like, they don't know we're looking at them because they're kind of in the background, but they're all acting. And I just thought it was amazing. I thought it was amazing. So, yeah, 10 out of 10, guys. Go see it, Mamma Mia. Lydia, hello, hello. They have to know all the lines exactly. It's fun to see you so excited about something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love my musicals. I love it. Good morning, Philippines. Good morning. Mm hmm. Exactly. You gotta act like all eyes on you. Exactly. It's hardwired for sure. What does that mean? Like it's tough? Oh, hard work. I was like hardwire like hardware yeah it is hard work maddie how are you dory hello um but yeah guys and then today uh, 
I didn't, I honestly didn't do too much. Um, lazy day today. Tomorrow I got family dinner at night. Um, and then it's a Thanksgiving dinner, so. Thanksgiving vibes. It's Thanksgiving on Monday here in Canada. Nicole, thank you for tapping. Karen, thank you. Jenny, go thank you. You might feel the same way next week. All eyes on you, even when you don't think we're looking. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm not nervous at all. Like, I was, I was very nervous for the first one. Tracy, thank you. Um, A1, let's go. Um, yeah, I was really nervous for the first one, but uh, this one I'm not. I don't know. Not at all. I'm actually more like excited than nervous. Last time was like half and half. Last time I was like freaking out, but I was also excited. This one, I don't feel it. Maybe because I met a ton of you already. So, hi, Donna. I'll be at my sister's Sunday for Thanksgiving. Yeah, it's weird that we're doing it on a Thursday, but um, that's what we're doing. Thursday, or Saturday. Saturday. Leaf game tomorrow, guys. They also won yesterday, which was awesome. Go Leafs, go. I don't know if anyone watched the game, but um finally won a game let's go celebrating thanksgiving tomorrow also let's go okay we're not alone Susie's celebrating it too not nervous cheryl's not nervous i saw samantha they should say she's not nervous good you got nothing to be nervous about honestly at least don't be nervous for me because as i always tell you guys i'm just that regular 28 year old i mean 32 year old <laughs> that's crazy that you guys, some of you have known me since I was 28, 29. Holy heck, we're going to be 40 soon, guys. You can be like, I met him. I, I knew him when he was just a little, you know. Hi, Riza. Melody, hello. it be so much fun, yeah. Thanks, Michelle, for organizing. Thanks for helping so much with it. I appreciate it. Basically 40. On our way on our way wait till you're my age um there's something else i wanted to say to you guys that i can't remember what's the head count this time i think 25 23 24 25 riza thank you where are you from from canada i'm 58 let's go go let's go um slow climb to the milestone guys but you know what video's taking off again is the um um riding solo video it's picking up again it was slowing down and now it's picking up again so that's good um it's on its way to 600k so it's nice to have videos that push um <clears throat> Is it less than last time? Um, I don't, I think it's like either the exact same or like one or two less. I'm gonna see, has it, how has it been two years? That's crazy, eh? Two years ago was the first one. So much can happen in two years, like so much change. Um, I'm just glad that two years later we're able to do it again. And I hope two years from now we can do another one, you know, keep it going. Then you can say you've known, known me for six years. Missy, hello, Tiffany, welcome, Kenya. 25 confirmed, possibly 28. Okay, then maybe a bit more. Maybe a bit more than last time, which makes sense. But as we're growing. The next one will be before two years, right? I can't make any guarantees. I don't want to say something and then no, but um, yeah, the, the Canada one's going to happen for sure. That'll probably happen in less than two years, the Canada one. But it'll be very, um, like, casual. Casual. Not two more years. We haven't even gone to the next one yet. All right, we'll, we'll think about it. Um, don't make the Canadians wait another two years. I won't make the Canadians wait another two years. Honestly, I plan on doing the, the Canada one like a year, like in 2025. Right? Yeah, 2025. Like, what year is it? So Canadians, hope to meet you too. Um, tappers, thank you guys. 20,000, 20,000 taps. Let's go, let's go. Wish I could come. Hey, anyone who can't come, you're there in spirit. You're there in spirit. We'll try to share some. I'm sure there'll be pictures and stuff. So, 
But I know it's not easy. It's not easy to jump on a plane spontaneously. Nicole, welcome back. Kenya, thanks for tapping. At least two weeks notice for the candle on. Yeah, 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 for sure. Um, like, honestly, like, I'll try to do, like, two, three months. You know what I mean? Give people a chance, even out of the country, to figure it out. But it'll be casual, very casual. Not a lot of planning for it. Just show up and see you guys. Reed wish you could do a Perth one. Nat and I would be there in a heartbeat. Yeah, eh? Perth? It's kind of a mission, though. But yeah, uh, I did one in Sydney. So I don't know if we'll do another Australia one. Um, I don't even know if we'll be back in Australia again, but keep you updated. We all show up in sweats, no makeup. Yeah, exactly. Sweats on, hair down, chilling with no makeup on. That's a Drake song, guys. That's a Drake song. Thank you. I'm excited for Florida. Very excited for Florida. Mark, thank you. Thank you. All right, let's get some music, guys. Musica. Musica. We are good. Mm -mm. All right, what song should we play? Uh, for anyone that's not on Facebook, uh, this was the picture from last night. Mamma mia. You know what I gotta do? Get to the freaking gym. Go to the gym. I gotta go to the gym, guys. Um, if I don't go before Florida, we're going every day in Florida. I'm punishing myself. Um, go to the gym, I know. But I, ju I did just weigh myself, and I don't know how this is possible because I ate so much in London, but I lost weight. Um, I'm like 150, I don't even know what I am now, but like it was less than before. So, but yeah. Yeah, maybe, uh, Maybe um, Sunday. Gym post, eat, sleep. Oh my goodness. It's gonna be 5 a.m. by the time that happens. <laughs> Teach me your ways. Let's go, let's go. I don't think you want my advice. I get lazy. You lost more weight. I don't know, like, I guess in London I did. Um, I don't know. Unless my scale is like glitchy. Oh, thank you. If you just sent to PayPal, thank you. It says, um, good to see you. Love the purple. Have a great day. Glad you had a good time at the show. Thank you so much, eh? Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank you for sending that. Thank you. Thank you. It was a good time at the show. Thank you. Hi, Cindy. Does anyone have any fun, um, weekend plans any fun weekend plans you did a lot of that's i think that was it because the walking i did walk a lot and we don't do that here so yeah that was probably the case um but i don't know nails and shopping home flying home but at least you're flying out soon love the sweatshirt thing it's special to me. I also don't have a lot of purple, so. Family dinner, bonfire, turkey, nice pumpkin patch for my daughter and grandsons. Work, 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 work. Let's play that song. Mm -hmm. 
do not sleep. Um, it's eight o'clock. So no, not yet. We got like 12 hours until sleep happens. Thank you, Riza. Thank you, thank you. No, hopefully not 12 hours. Hopefully like eight. Even eight's too much. We gotta go to bed in seven hours. Seven. Don't want to ask what time I went to bed last night. It's not important. Um, shame on me again. Shame, shame. Lona, hello, yeah, something like five. Um, but hey, at least at least I don't wake up at like <laughs> four p.m. Because I swear I would. I'd keep sleeping, but I have to set an alarm. It's like I'll just sleep all day. Seven a.m. No, it was not late. No, I've got at least another eight hours. Hey, let's go, night owls, unite. Hi, Trina. Shane Nichols wants to go live. Uh, we know what happens. I'm good. I'm good. No Shane Nichols vibes. I still have PTSD. Didn't get much sleep because of my appointment. Yo, thank you. Happy Thanksgiving. Wishing you happiness and love always. Yo, thank you so much. Super kind. Damn. Thank you so much. If you just sent that, holy heck. Holy heck, happy Thanksgiving. Yeah, you guys gotta celebrate the uh, the Canadian Thanksgiving too, okay? What happens with Shane? Oh, he took our streak. <laughs> thank you, thank you if you just sent that PayPal. Super generous, thank you. You know who you are, you know who you are. Hi, Debbie. Yeah, the Shane Nichols vibe. Happy Thanksgiving Monday. Monday, uh, Monday is th it's Thanksgiving weekend though. Like it's Thanksgiving weekend. But hey, what am I thankful for? I think someone asked that, but I saw it in reply. What am I thankful for? Definitely thankful for my family. I'm thankful for my friends. I'm thankful for Blocky Fam. I'm thankful for the health of my family and my friends and my own health. I'm thankful for the fact that I get to do this all the time. I love this. This makes me so happy. So I'm thankful to be a creator. Thankful for my past experiences, even the t the hard times, because it's shaped me to who I am. Um, yeah, I'm definitely thankful for a lot. It's harder to be thankful in some days because I'm um, maybe like going through something and I can't see like the positive or whatever. But I'd say overall, I'm very thankful. I'm very lucky, very lucky for certain things in my life. What are you guys thankful for? Or you can answer it on your Thanksgiving if you want. Canadian Thanksgiving menu, turkey, gravy, and stuffing. I love, I love stuffing. I love stuffing. You, thanks. I'm cleaning as we have family coming to stay. No worries, thanks for stopping in, Leanne. You. Okay, but no, actually though, for you. Okay, but actually, 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 health, let's go. Health is important. Health is super important. Um, take care of your health, always. Your mental health, your physical health, it's huge. If your health is not taken care of, it's gonna lead to issues and stress. Health, family, nature, touch grass then. You, imagine that. Hey, let's go. I think of my son got stationed very close to me. That's awesome, It's good. Thankful for every moment I can't see you. Oh, you guys are too kind. <laughs> too kind. Too kind. Thank you. Thanks for the close relationship. Thankful for the close relationship I have with my kids. That's good. It's good to have that. Good. I'm I'm happy that you guys can list things because the moment we list things that we're grateful for, it will probably allow us to feel a bit better, right? Because, I don't know, catch yourself the next time you're in a bad mood and see whether or not you're actually thankful or feeling thankful probably not probably not because your mind's in a bad place you're negative right so it's hard to it's hard to always be thankful but there's always it's always there 
Thankful I'm getting my car fixed. Hey, that's good. Yep. Thankful for all the blessings in my life, including you and Blackie fam. Blackie fam is definitely a blessing, not just to me, but to you guys. You know what I mean? And I'm seeing that more and more in the last year. It's just how much, I mean, I, I love that you guys want to be in the lives to, to see me. But, you know, just the fact that you guys are happy to be around each other is huge. Um, like little things that like no one would notice. But like when I see like, I'll like see like that people will use black hearts. Like Blackie fam will use black hearts when they're like communicating with other people on their posts. And I love that. Like that makes me feel good because I'm like, yo, it's a movement. It's a movement. And I love that you guys do that because it makes me feel, um, I guess like proud. I just feel like proud. I love it. So keep spreading those black hearts. It's a movement. I love that. It's a very strong form of love. Thankful for my kids and my close relationships with them. That's good. Keep them close. Keep them close. Yep. What's your favorite movie? The Hand That Rocks the Cradle. Love the black hearts, let's go. Black hearts are part of me now, I use them at work. Amazing, wait, I'm actually curious. Does anyone use, other than Maria, does anyone use black hearts when they like text their like friends outside of TikTok, or their family outside of TikTok? Like, has anyone actually adopted the black heart into their, into their life outside of social media? Yes, love that. Bye, Dottie. Have a safe flight. Safe flight. Thankful for my 87-year-old mom and cancer-free. Hey, let's go. Your niece, Sarah. Grateful for Sarah. Lisa, Lisa, much love. Blackheart jewelry is a must. Thank you, Zen. Black hearted beaded bracelet. Amazing. So it's a part of you. Happy Thanksgiving to you and your family and to all Blocky fam and your families. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. When's American Thanksgiving? Is it when I'm in uh, Florida? I think I leave on like the 8th or the 7th. Alexa, when is American Thanksgiving? Here is an answer from an Alexa Answers contributor that I translated. November 28th. Thanksgiving Day is Thursday, November 24th, 2020. 24, or Would the you weekend. Would like a Thanksgiving joke? Thanksgiving joke? Sure. Why is the turkey never afraid? Because he's not a chicken. Okay, Alexa, give me a Thanksgiving joke that makes me laugh. At Thanksgiving, many people give thanks that their relatives will eventually go home. <laughs> that's actually funny. That's so dark, though. Alexa, that's mean. Not all of us do I that. I never mean to be mean. I know, but that was a mean joke. So go, go, go into the corner. Bad joke. My black heart bracelet has a beat. I love you. Let's go. She's always causing issues, eh? Always. True at times. Yeah. I listen, I love my space. I love my alone time, so. But, come on, it's Thanksgiving, Alexa. Fuck. Lana, hello. How are you? Purple's your favorite? Nice, nice, nice. Can't say the same. Cannot say the same. But, I think I have three things that are purple. Tiffany, thank you for the pumpkin. Blue's your favorite? My favorite color. Other than black is royal blue. I love royal blue. My eyes aren't purple today, guys. <laughs> Red. Good, how are you? I'm good. Better than yesterday. Yesterday was bad during the day. Today I was kind of anxious, but... My earrings, necklaces, watch band, headband, socks, shirt have a black heart. Damn. Now you just gotta get a tattoo. Is your headache gone? It's not bad, but it's there. Yeah. Like yesterday was brutal. Actually, at some point today it was brutal. 
but now it's not bad. I got a drink though. Yankee hat's clean, let's go. Thank you, eh? I don't need it just yet though. I'm sure it needs to dry. The pop socket, what's a pop socket? Pop socket? Eh? Tap, tap guys, tap, tap, tap the screen. Thank you so much, I appreciate Debbie tapping. Thank you, Cindy. Thank you, the thing for your back of your phone. <laughs> the thing for your back of your phone. Wait, I don't, I can't picture that. Thinking of a new tat, nice. How many tattoos do you have, Not. It's round. Well, that doesn't help, everything's round. A round thing on the back of the phone? Like the MagSafe thing? Hold your phone. Oh, is it that thing that like you go like this with? Like you put your, it like sits in between here and it like, I know what you're talking about. You stick it on, Google it. I know I have the laptop or iPad right in front of me. We're lazy, Jerry. It is that thing, the one, yeah, okay. Um, I've never had one, so that would be kind of annoying, no? Doesn't it get like, doesn't it like stick out in your pocket? Just like you have like a little bulge in your pocket. It's not good. No, it doesn't. Okay, so it just disappears. Brandy's got one. It flattens. Oh. Hmm. All right. How's your day? It was good. Not too eventful. Thank you for asking. How's your day? It's also a stand. Oh, I use it like I'm using the stand right now. I use this stand all the time. Yeah. Guys, do you know? I'm not even joking. Let's see if I can see it. Um, I have. So I don't know if you guys. Okay, whose pinky right now is under their phone? Let's do a quick poll. Whose pinky is under their phone right now? Smiley face, yes. Sad face, your pinky is not under your phone. Smiley face, your pinky is under your phone, holding it or whatever you're holding. Okay, so for the last two and a half years, I always hold, I always put my pinky under the phone. So I like, I hold it and then my pinky is like where the charger is, where the charger goes. I literally have indented my finger. Like it's permanent. I have a permanent TikTok indent. Um, just from holding it so much there in the last three years, like whether it's on lives or like when I'm catching up on notifications. So maybe I should switch hands so that it matches. So I can have an indent here and an indent here. Just wait till you have a wedding ring. Well, I mean, even this one, like, I don't know if you guys can see it, but see, like it's indented. Yeah. You too. Let's go, Indent Twins. Oh, we got everyone live right now. Alex is live. Jacques is live. Alex Boyd is live. Ivan's live. Let's go. It's Friday night. Everyone's live. Terry, hello. My pinky is permanently away from other fingers. Oh yeah? My right pinky has a very noticeable dent from the phone. Same. Mine's act like it actually goes in. Like I could put rice in this indent and like save it for dinner. Like that's how deep this indent is. Like I should use it for rice, guys. You never know when you're gonna hungry. And then you can just take it out, eat it, you know? It's so convenient. You don't have to cook, it's already in your finger. Brandy, welcome. I may not more. I may 
know more about you than anyone else in my life. Really? Is that a good thing? Ray in my finger gravy, oh sorry, rice in finger gravy and shoulder done. Yes, exactly. We take, wait, rice and gravy? I've never had rice with gravy, but yeah, I mean, we could put rice here, gravy there, and then we just pick it up, add some gravy, you know, refill it when it needs to get refilled with our rice. One grain at a time though, okay? Except my kids, you. Why wow, you guys think you know me so well? All right, I'm gonna give you guys a question then. You see if you got this right. I gotta think of a hard question though about me that I've definitely said before. Okay. Hmm. All right, I got a good one. No one's getting this, but I have mentioned it on a live. Gia, welcome, welcome. Who is my roommate in university? What was his first name? If you guys get this, I'm shocked, but I have said it before on a live. He's the one that's like super successful. He has his own company where he connects, um, he connects uh, brands with um, influencers. Stumped you, Tim. No, Tim's my haircut guy. That's funny that you said that. No, it's not Michael. All right, stumped you all. Let's go. I did say that. All right, I'll give you an easier question. Why are we all saying Tim? Um, I'll give you an easier one. The answer is Brian, but I'll give you an easier one. Um, Sif was close. Okay. Hmm. Um, what year was Black 18 Sis born? Honestly, if you get this, I'll be pretty shocked but not too shocked. Like there will be people who get it. What year was Blackie 18 sis born? Oh, we'll wait for your answers in the chat. I feel like if you know when I'm born, it's easy, right? No, yeah, we're getting it. That was too easy. We can count. All right, fine. 88. Okay. All right, all right, all right. I got one. What month was Blackie 18 mom born? Math questions? Uh, I can I can do that. What month was Blackie eighteen? Mom born. That's actually insane. That Blackie eighteen mom knows. <laughs> January is right. Wow. Okay. Um. How many How many nights am I going to Florida for? We write things down. If you get this right, damn. How many days exactly? I think it's exactly. I gotta count again, but I'm pretty sure it's this. Oh, we're pretty close. Okay. Uh, anyone got it exactly though? 23. 23. 21, 22, basically. Yeah, 23. Yes. All right, you guys know me. <laughs> you all passed. Okay, Jen, how are you? I hope uh, no damage. Hope everything's okay. I know you're in Florida. Who else is in Florida? Lisa, Amy. Yeah, anyone in Josh? Anyone in Florida area? Hope you're okay. Uh, I think that's that's it. I can't think of any more Floridians. Read math. Do you know us? Yeah. But I don't know, I definitely don't know you all the way you know me. But I definitely know stuff about some of you. Have you heard from Josh? Yeah, I spoke to Josh uh, two days ago. Three days ago. But yeah, I did, we, we wrote for a bit. You were very lucky, but, oh, we were very lucky, but flooding on both sides of the of the hood. So I'm staying in Alabama a bit longer. Oh, I'm glad you have somewhere to go. Josh is good. Amy's okay. Awesome. 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 Glad everyone's safe and sound. Scary stuff. Scary stuff. What's going on? For sure. Um, 
think I told you guys, but Riri was like, you should, you still want to move to Florida? Yes. One day. I can see myself being a, uh, doing what Silver Fox does. I like your curly hair. It's amazing. Thank you. I'm hiding all of it right now because it's such a mess. Curls out or curls in? <laughs> Um, Annabella, hello, hello. Texas, we can, what does it say? You can move to Texas, we can visit Florida. I think I'm moving to Texas. Oh, but a little bit in. Oh, I see what you're saying. Okay, just, just, just a couple. Just, okay, let's go. I follow you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Who was it that I was talking to? And they said they've been through an earthquake. I can't remember. I lived in Central Texas three years. I enjoyed it a lot. All right, guys. I don't want to tell anyone, but we are moving to Texas. Um, imagine. Imagine I just said it so casually. I admire your hair. Thank you. Thanks. Tappers, thank you. We are tapping a lot. Thank you, guys. 40,000 taps. Appreciate it. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Question is where? Oh, guys, if you're in Texas, go see Mau Mia. It's playing in San Antonio, Dallas, and Houston. Go see it. Uh, I think when I, I was looking through the list and I saw Texas and I was like, Texans, go see it. There's nothing else to do in Texas anyways. You know what I mean? So might as well. Might as well. I think it's April that they're in Texas, but you'll have to check. But go see it. Go see it. You better bring Gia's Marner card. That's weird that you believe it's Gia's. <laughs> it's interesting. Michelle, thank you. Show was great. Thank you. Thank you. Cat, welcome. Cat, go see Mommy in Texas. Go. Oh. I want someone to go see it, just so I can talk about it. Well, well, well. So, who? Susie. Thank you. I'm silly. You are silly. You are very silly. Um... Lydia, I'm not going to accept today. Not today, but thank you for the request. I'm a tired saucy today. Yeah, but that's like minimal. Like, you know what I mean? That's because you don't, you never have sass anyways. So it's like, I don't even know if I'll notice the tad. Noor, hello, hello. I'm not saucy today, can you tell? Where are you from? Canada. The movie was great. The Mummy movie. <laughs> so I can't come in. I just want to make sure that's actually Gia. Okay, it is. Because we know what happened last time. Okay, I just want to make sure. Now I'm like super skeptical. Um, don't interrupt while I'm t talking to Aaron, please. Excuse me? Do I need to mute you? I can sense the sass. You just wait. If you think that's sass. Debbie and I saw mommy at the Playhouse in Memphis 10 years ago. Let's go. I wonder if uh, a lot of the same um, cast. The one who played the one who gets married in Mamma Mia, she looked like my age. Like around 30. So I'm sure she hasn't been around too long. But like... The rest of the cast, they were older, a lot of them. When people were accidentally joining the lot. Yeah, 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 exactly. Gotta look out, no fakes. Um, you will work. You will work? I am working. Um.
Let's play this. Guys, this is the first time someone dropped a bongo emote since I've been home. Other than the time I called you guys out for not paying attention to bongo, but this is the first time that bongo's been dropped in the chat without him being mentioned or seen. And now Samantha's just following Gia, you know what I mean? But yes, bongo is still a thing, guys. I love him, I know you guys don't, but like, I still love him. So, at least I can show you love, okay? Get a Saba emote. <laughs> I don't think I have space. Uh, yeah, I think there's like one more left. Newer, hello. And now we're dropping Bongo emotes, now. Okay, guys, Bongo, they're dropping your emotes. They haven't forgot about you. We love Bongo. Hey, you sure? He's the only reason I'm here. Oh, oh, that burns. Hi Lydia. It's free. Lionel emote next. I didn't get an invite to the party. Bongo and I are on a break. On a break, eh? <laughs> Jenny, welcome, welcome. Uh, oh, this is tempting. Uh, guys, we accept Charlie. I think if I'm pretty sure we lose our streak if we don't battle for a month. I think it's been like three weeks. I don't know exactly, but maybe we should do one today or soon to keep the streak alive. You know, don't want to lose it. Um, I don't remember the last one, guys. So, do it. Let's go. Jen's pumped. All right, guys. You want to do one? Okay. Um. The question is like, who? Thank you for the rose. You did one on the first. I did? No. Who? I did? I can't remember. I can't remember. But no, we said we we're going to remember Ange, and we said no. Yeah, we we're going to. Miko, thank you. Jaw hurt. Um, yeah, it did. It did, but it hasn't been hurting. I think I um, I'm just pushing on it too much. I gotta leave her alone. Say hi to Charlie and see if he went into a battle. Usually when I decline, they just go with someone else. He is with someone else. <laughs> oh, Spencer Pratt's live. No way, the guy's back on live? Do you guys know that it's been two years since that battle? That's crazy. I haven't seen Spencer Pratt online in like months. He's back. Two years, it was two years, it was, I think it was May. May of 2022? So when I was back from the, or, no, that was 2023. Was it 2023 or 2022? Have you married? I'm not yet. I'm going to get married maybe soon. I don't, I haven't found um, that person, but hopefully they like knock on my door and then we can get married. You watched the battle with Spencer late last night. That was crazy. That was wild. That was really special. Dottie's asking. Dottie's here. I thought she left. I thought she's taking a plane. <laughs> Last, I knew it. I knew it was a while ago. Okay. Wait, 923? September 23rd. Okay. So it's not a month, but... Two and a half weeks, three weeks almost. She's everywhere. She's everywhere. Um, all right, we'll we'll see. We'll see what the vibe is, guys. Thank you for the pumpkin.
Tap, tap, guys. Almost 50,000. Keep tapping that screen. Hey, holiday. Got a holiday coming up. Let's go, let's go. Good morning. I hope you are refreshed and happy. Thank you, thank you. Jane, welcome. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Teresa, welcome, welcome. Jane, welcome. No, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. Teresa, welcome, welcome. If we took a half day. Mm, someone wants to go live. It says we co host here three days ago. Um, was this the one where I was sleeping? I don't know who this is. No, no, no. Yes! Have you visited my country, Indonesia? Um, no. I've never been to Indonesia before. But I've been close. I've been close to your country. Kristen, welcome, welcome. Happy holiday, Canada. Let's go Thanksgiving. <laughs> Turkey vibes. Damn it, Diana. Oh. No. Yes. Yeah. Damn it, Reed. Every time, eh? Every time. Love a new hoodie. Thank you, Kristen. I love it too. Oh, guys, we gotta cook the salmon soon. It's it's literally gonna like I might not be able to eat it soon. Um, come to Bali, maybe one day. You don't know? <laughs> yeah. Did you go to Western? Yeah, I went to this university. I did for five years, four years plus teachers' college. You know what's crazy? The diplomas look the same. You'd think in like 10 years they'd update it, but uh, I was in the bookstore and they had the same diplomas, same diplomas. Good morning, Maria Repuranda. You haven't cooked yet? No, I haven't cooked it yet. Salmon check. But no, we looked online and it says it's good for months, so we'll just cook it in 2025. You went to Ryerson, nice. It's called something else now, eh? It's not called Ryerson. It's called, what is Ryerson called now? It's called uh, TMU. It's called Toronto Metropolitan University. They changed its name. Do I like cooking? I love cooking. It's like my way of relaxing. So like I do it when I need to like, you know, sometimes I deep breathe and then sometimes I just cook. Depends on my mood. Yeah, it's like therapy for me. Lies. No, no. Just cause you don't cook doesn't mean that it's a lie. Okay. He loves to wash dishes too. Yeah, but paper plates are awesome though. So we don't have to do that. I had to inquire a new diploma and all new stuff. Really? Why? Oh, because because they changed the name. True. In what world? Um, Earth. Where's Sava? Please, please, please. Where is Sava? Oh, he's at the cottage, I think. I think he's at the cottage. Yeah, I think. He just snapped me today. But... I do miss Saba, same. I think you guys miss him more than I do though. Is that the gem? Probably, <laughs> probably. Yeah, he's grinding. He's putting in that work. <laughs> Where's your loose tube? I got so many tubes. We should do a toque fashion show, you know? But yeah, I have a loose toque. I don't know. This one's sick. Yeah, bud. It's almost toque season though. We're here a bit early, but it's basically toque season. 
Next week, it's going to be 11 degree high for Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. 11 degrees is 52. So yeah, it's getting cold here, guys. 52 next week. How old are you? Uh, you have to guess. Guess. How old do you think I am? Get the red carpet out. <laughs> yeah, model show. Let's go for a rip of the Duke's bud. Yeah, I might as well grab a freaking double double while we're at it, you know? And say hi to our beavers in the forest, too. Right? Play some buck. You wanna play some buck on the pond? Mm hmm. Take a slap shot. Hi, Melba. See the beavers? The moose, the meese. Terza, thank you. Thank you for talking. Good morning, Donna. I love how we're all in different time zones. Like some of us are eating breakfast, some of us it's like dinner time. So we see all the time good mornings, good night, I'm going to bed, I'm just waking up. We're all over the world. I owe you a toonie. Oh no, for sure. Oh no, no, no. No, you don't owe me a toonie. Okay? Just give me a loony and we're good. Alright? I don't want to take too much from you. But yeah, I'll take the loony. I'll take that. If you have one. If not, just give me a couple quarters and call it a deal. You know? Yeah. Why does the Canadian accent sound like we're like... I don't know what, like what even this Canadian accent is. I don't know who sounds like this in Canada. Maybe like British... No, like Saskatchewan or like... I think Nova Scotia, they talk like that. I just want bongo. If I get bongo, then I better see that smile. Tipsy by Jay Kwan. Tipsy. Oh, is that like everybody in the club getting tipsy? Jen wants it, alright. Uh, guys, only because I love you, okay? I don't do this for everyone, okay? <laughs> Caption this! Yeah! We're rocking him like he's not 27 years old. There he is, there's your guy. Say hi, don't be rude. All right, all right, all right, all right. Yes, yes, yes. He loves sniffing my ear. He loves it. You like the smell of earwax, don't you? Yeah, it smells better than bananas. I know. I know. Okay. Thank you for the kiss. Did you mean to get him? You can get him instead. Oh, yeah. Bongo, just go for the kiss. You don't have to stare into their soul. Just go right in for it. Let's go, Jen. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. He's shy. He gets it from his father. His father. Yeah. Lionel's turn now. Are you kidding me? If I get Lionel off of his area, everything falls. Everything. Like, it is it is so meticulously placed that if I even move Lionel's, like, whisker, the whole thing falls. Everything collapses. Like, it took me, like, so long to get it just to sit like that, so you can't touch Lionel. The only time we, we touch Lionel is to put him on the, on the ledge, which I don't think he's earned it yet, so... Sounds like a you problem. Oh, sassy Michelle, my goodness. Yeah, it is a me problem though. But guess what? It's your problem too, because you don't get to see him. But I will bring, I will bring, we'll do a little field trip to uh, see him. All right, bud. You get attention too. There you go, bud. Yeah. You're looking, uh, you're looking rough, man. Have you showered? You smell like, you smell like, um, Lion, see something fell. <laughs> this is my special hat. Don't read it, okay? It's it's bad words, but it's very special to me.
my robot fall. No, your robot's in my uh, TV room. What's holding the Supreme sticker up? That's a great question. It's actually Boone's tail. Boone's tail is holding it up. And the tail is actually pushing on Lionel's paw to keep Lionel up. And Lionel's holding on to uh, Blackie Bear just to make sure that, uh, you know, nothing happens to him either. So, Was that a troll, Michelle? I missed that. What to say? I can handle it. What to say? Oh, it's definitely mean. It just got blocked. What to say, guys? You can say it in the chat. Just say it because then I'm gonna have FOMO. So just say what he said. I gotta see it. Just say it. But put quotation marks so it doesn't. It doesn't sound like you're saying it. It was dumb. I can take it. Guys. <laughs> was it would you rather? I want to... Alright guys, I'm going to do a would you rather with you guys right now. Because he spoiled it. Okay. Would you rather have smelly feet or bad breath? That's hard. Laura thinks. Smelly feet or bad breath? Honestly, probably feet. Probably feet. Um, I, um, yeah, feet. I was about to do story time, but no. Feet, yeah, I'll take the smelly feet. Okay. Yeah, no bad breath. I, that's why I need my tongue scraper. Guys, I literally, like, scrape my tongue until, like, it's, like, shedding skin. I swear. Ange wants to go live. No, Ange. No. Guys, yes or no to Ange? Quick. I'm going to say no to her. Because she always says no to me. So, like, no. So, would you rather your dad be... I missed it. <sighs> Smelly feet on the plane. Would you rather uncontrol? Yeah, I think it was a typo. Would you rather um, communicate telepathically or know every single language on the planet? Tracy P, welcome. I see you, you sneaky. Uh, would you rather communicate te telepathically or know every single language on the planet? I thought Michelle was saying that. Oh, that's what the troll said. Okay, I should have known that because you put quotation marks. You even followed my instructions and I still thought it was you. What a silly question. Okay, glad you blocked him. Get out of here. I thought I thought you were saying that, but I told you to use quotation marks, so I should have been ready for that. But I know I was like, wait, I was that's why I was like typo. I was like typo. That's so not Michelle. Never mind, never mind, it's fine, it's fine. It's good, it's good. That's funny though. You really do forget everything you said. I think like normally I'm fine guys. It's just cause I have so much information being thrown at me. My brain right now, like whenever I'm live, there's like so much happening. And plus I have my own thoughts. So it's like pew, 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 pew. Good evening MB. Good evening, good evening. Good evening, good evening. Just relax. I'm relaxed. You wanna play Pictionary? Okay, I'm gonna make up my own word about this time.
Wow, that is the worst ghost I've ever drawn ever. What the heck is that? I've never seen one, so I don't know how to draw it. You know what I mean? But based on what I think it would look like, it's probably that. Yeah, that's probably what it would look like if it, if I could see it. But all right, sixteen people got it. Um, where was pumpkin? That's what that white thing is. Yeah, just so I can incorporate the Halloween to it, you know. Jerry, you were first. Sixteen people got it right. If you said pumpkin, you got it right. Okay. We'll do one more, but I'm gonna make up my own. Um, um, I am a good boy. I am. Yes, I also am an artist. That's very good. Come on, no one's getting it. What am I? I'm a good what? Oh my goodness. Wow, guys. The fact that we're not getting this is so upsetting. The words cook. What the heck? Why would no one get that right? I do appreciate everyone saying good person, good friend. Good creator but yeah guys Jen you got it first you got it first kiss her I hope I wouldn't know and you said chef close enough close enough I like my original answer better they were good guys very creative well done well done I'm impressed yeah very very impressed Let me find out. Michi, thank you for the follow. Does anyone have one of these guys? I asked, but no one answers. Does anyone have an air tag? Anyone have an air tag? These things are cool. I want to get one. Um, I want to put one in my wallet. No? It's so easy to set up. I love it. It's just in case you like lose your keys, it tells you where it is. So it's like a tracker. So like, let's just say like I leave my keys at like, I don't know, a movie theater. It'll tell me like where my keys are. So it like tracks it. Has anyone ever lost their keys? There you go. It's useful. Sylvia, what's up, what's up? Um, but yeah, now I'm like, now that I have all my keys, I'm like, my wallet needs one. Did you lose your keys? No, I never lose my keys. <laughs> but I guarantee, I guarantee people will have lost their keys before that would have been like, oh, I should have put it on, you know? Yeah. Chip one on you so I don't get lost? Yeah, honestly, I should. Should put one, like, I should implant, like, put one of these, like, inside me. You know what I mean? Like, it's like a heart tracker, but it's for Apple. That way, you know? I know exactly where I am at all times. I just, it pulls out a map. It's good if you misplace the keys. Exactly. It's also voice activated. No, it's not. But yeah, it's an Apple chip. Mm -hmm. I don't think OCD would allow the loss of keys. But yeah, like you don't understand. I'm so picky with where my keys go on my dresser that one day when I had my car repaired, I totally forgot that my key, like I, I left my keys with the car repair guy. And when I came home, like a day later, I was like, where are my keys? They're always here. What the heck? Did I lose them? You know, cause I always have things in the exact same spot. Like if this pen is moved a little bit, <laughs> I know 